Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Danielle, AKA Stitcherista here on YouTube. And today is a Diamond Art Club unboxing. Haven't bought one of their kits since June, I know. There have been so many really awesome ones. Some of them though are square and I just don't do squares anymore. But I saw this one and had to have it. And I also bought a pack of their release paper that they now have. So the release paper, it's 200 sheets. And they're each uh, five by five inches by 7.9 inches. And this was $14.99. So let's take a look at these before I break open the kit. And it's wrapped like an envelope. And yeah, they're gorgeous. Okay. Yeah, so they have the Diamond Art Club logo on them. And I like the release papers only because um, this is what I use when I pull, I pull the clear cover off and like to cover it. Now, these are a little bit bigger than what I normally use, but that's a good, that's a good bit of a section. Meaning, I actually like these very much. I'm actually going to pull these out of the paper and just put them back in the box themselves, which I will do that when I'm done the video. <laughs> Instead of spending the time to do that right now, right? Okay, but the kit that I bought was Faces of Fairy 132 by Jasmine Beckett Griffith. Absolutely loved this one when I saw it. This is round diamonds and it's 51 centimeters by 51 centimeters. And it has 46 colors, including four AB diamonds. So we will take a peek definitely at the AB diamonds. I normally am not someone who goes through all of the diamond colors. We all know what the colors look like. So there is the little sticker, like if you want to put in your journal. And the normal toolkit that has pen, wax, little baggies, all that good stuff. And then, of course, Diamond Art Club packages theirs in a plastic bag that has their logo on it. And I never keep mine in the bag. Once I pull it out of the bag, you know, do the unboxing, I uh, just put the canvas back in the box. I've never had a canvas be messed up or hurt or anything like that. Diamond Art Club uses poured glue which nine times out of 10, there are no bubbles or rivers or anything in their canvases. And they use a toppling canvas, which let me, the back is like velvety and it makes it, um, uh, very pliable and easy to handle and move around and all of that. So here are the diamonds. I'm, I'm actually not going to pull these out of the package. I'm going to try and look, though, on this sticker because here's the sticker with the key. I'm going to try to see which ones are AB diamonds. But this one is not very big at all. And isn't it gorgeous? The, you can tell. You can just tell this one is going to be very, very stunning. Now, Diamond Art Club does put the key up in the top left and in the bottom right. And... It makes me want to start this one right now. Diamond Art Club truly has the most vibrant canvases that I've ever seen in diamond painting. And I have bought quite a bit of canvases. They, it's very, also one of the stickiest ones that I've ever encountered. You can actually really tell what this is going to look like when you glance at it. It's gorgeous. I absolutely love Jasmine Beckett Griffith's artwork. So the four ABs look like white, a lime green, a yellow, all of those release papers just fell on the floor. Um, lime green, light yellow, and then like a pink. So maybe in her face. Yeah. Now what I like to do with this, because with these, you have to kit them up because they are in individual bags. I put these on the, um, pill containers that I use. Yeah, it works out very, very well. 
Okay, it's gorgeous, right? Did you guys get this kit? Let me know down below. So this kit was $39.99. And for a total of the release papers and the kit, I paid $7.99 in shipping. $2.97 in tax. And so my total bill was $60.45. This is so pretty for Christmas. I absolutely love it. I just love, love, love the... The big eyes and the face and the Christmas hat and the little candy cane up there. But yeah, so that's it. My unboxings are very short and sweet. As always, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments section below. And I will answer them to the best of my ability. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. And I will see you in my next video. Oh, I forgot to tell you. There's 46 colors in this. That's actually quite a bit for something that's not really big, but that means there's probably really good shading and detail. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.